She's good at this. She's <laughs> this is a yeah. You won. Hi, I'm Perish de Mubashri. I teach at Santa Monica College and uh, I've been in charge of this whole event of uh, Santa Monica and I'm really proud to present to you the best fashion show winners of our show, Michelle, who won the first prize for the fashion image and she, sh she used her grandmother, which, is, which I think was even lovelier, and she did hers. If you look at the picture, you can see it even better. It was before and after. It was a makeover of her and she did a wonderful job and as you notice, she won the first prize. The second are John and Mugger. They work as a team and I think they did a wonderful job also. They won the first prize in menswear and as you have their garments on now, which you notice in the show, which was just wonderful and I'm really proud of them. We have had a lot of other students in the show. One of them is standing <laughs> right behind and we had others who already left unfortunately. But they did wonderful. Thank you so much. So you were in his show. Did, did a lot of people start going clapping? Yeah, did you because notice? Because they did, they did that. Did you notice that? Did, did you notice people clapping for that? Okay. Yeah. Here we're rolling. They did it. Okay. Rolling. 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 Okay. okay. Let's right into it. Teddy, you want to start at the side? Hi, you're at California Mart and we just had two first prize winners in our categories and we did wonderful. Well, let me just go back and tell you what has happened during that, this past three years that I'm working for Santa Monica College. When I started, unfortunately or fortunately, the department was not all that big. We didn't have that many students. The students that we had were confused because they didn't know what to take because they weren't all that many courses available to them. Now, after three years working hard with the students, I have come to the conclusion that we are probably in the best location. We have a lot of talented students and that proved to me today. The only thing that was missing, it was the instructors and the people who would work with the students individually. I have been working very hard to get these things done, and we got it. Today, we won two first prizes. I am one of the committee members of Fashion Symposium. What Fashion Symposium Committee does, each year we have an event, which is between all the community colleges. What we do, we have different categories that these students could become involved and enter. This year we had over 13 different categories and students could have entered each category as many as they wanted to. Our students entered probably more than 13 uh, different garments and they involved in many different phases. Now, what happened, um, in a way kind of disappointed why we didn't win as many as I expected because we had a lot of good prospects there but two is better than none. The first prize winner is Michelle. She worked very hard and she had more than four garments in the show and she did a fashion image which was a fashion image which, is, which you can see on the wall. What she did, she took her grandmother before and after and she did her completely uh, wardrobe and her coloring and everything and she did a very good job and she won the first prize in the fashion merchandising. Then we have two other gentlemen here who work together as a team and Murad, <laughs> John, they did three garments, which again won the first prize in the men's category. 
as you see, the three garments are done in a spectacular way, and I'm very proud of them. We had other categories and other garments in the show that did not win a, <laughs> any prize, but still, I think they are each one of them are a piece of art, and it's fabulous. <laughs> I get you to talk about the oh. talk about how she Okay, now I would like to let Michelle talk. Oh, yeah, well, uh -huh. <laughs> no, don't do that to her. She's already too nervous. <laughs> okay. Now I would like to ask Michelle to tell us how she started and how she put all these things together and what made her decide to choose her grandma. Michelle? Well, I thought it would be a really great category to enter. I thought it would be something that I would have a chance to win at. And I thought my grandma would be a good category because she isn't like the perfect, you know, like a lot of people, they want to make people look like they are a magazine model. And I thought that a lot of people would do that and it wouldn't be very original. So I chose my grandma because I found a lot wrong and she was loving enough to just let me completely redo her. And I think you did a great job. Thank you. And how about you, Morat and John? Now we're going to ask John and Morat how they got started. Okay, well, we first got started in a Fashion One class. I took the class and I did not know him before, but we met each other in the Fashion One class and we got together and Mabashri wanted us to do the fashion competition together. So we went in together and we put a lot of hard work, a lot of effort, and we made it. We got the first prize. <laughs> All right. Well, their, their design came originally from the first semester when they were working for different projects. That's and how we started up. We tried to get together for the first project, which we said we could do. And after we saw that we can work it out to work together, we said, why don't we go in for the fashion competition? And it worked out. Like it, worked out. <laughs> it worked out With way the help well. from Miss Wabashiri, of course. Of she course, was the one you? who pushed us day and night. Yes. <laughs> and we had to stay up till 4 o'clock in the morning to work on these things, but... It's worth it. It worked. It was worth it. She's and a good teacher. Oh, thank you. <laughs> well, I think that wraps up everything. Um, again, very thankful for all of you and very proud to see that this event gave us two first prize winners. I hope that next year we could enter more categories and hopefully we even win more for Santa Monica College. just concluded the third annual California Community College Fashion Symposium. This is a joint effort between education and industry. Industry contributing the beautiful California Mart free, compliments of the owner, Sid Morse, who welcomes us to present our event where over 60 speakers from industry come to speak to students interested in careers in fashion educators from all over the state join together to organize and promote this exciting day. We honor outstanding students from the community college system who have created exciting entries. We received over 800 this year. So this is truly a joint effort of many people coming together to share their ideas, to exchange hopes and dreams, and hopefully to come out with very, very positive careers in the fashion industry. 